in Santa Carla, I never could stomach. All the damn vampires. Hello, John from Mondo Televet Movies. This is my competition entry for your 600 subscriber competition. Now, what John wants to know is what's your most prized possession in your collection, and also what is your guilty pleasure in your collection. Now, John had some nice ones. He had a signed photo from the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. I can't compete with that because all I've got is a signed copy of Keith and Orville and Cuddles. And you can see there, Keith signed it. That obviously doesn't compete with his. And his guilty pleasure was Enchanted, which I don't think it's a guilty pleasure. I've got this as well. I think it's a great movie. You can see there, I've got the DVD. If you move it, it should turn some cartoon. Which I think is pretty cool. But anyway, under my prized possession. Now this is my prized possession. Not for what it is, not for what it's worth or anything like that. But these are the DVDs. I haven't even upgraded them to Blu-ray. But these are the DVDs I've watched the most out of my entire collection. And it, it is the Rocky Collection. I've watched these movies so many times. It's unbelievable how many times I've watched these movies. And not just one, I've watched them all. Rocky 1, Rocky 2, Rocky 3, Rocky 4. That's upside down. Rocky 5. And... Rocky Balboa. I, I used to have these on VHS as well, and that would have been a prize, but I, I gave that away. But I've watched these movies just... I, I still remember why I watched these movies as well. I went to my granddad's, I must have been about nine, ten years old, and Rocky II was on the TV, and I was just like, wow. Went out, bought it with me, I think it was with my birthday money. I've just been a massive fan of Rocky, so that is my... Prize possession. I'll never get rid of that. I should probably just upgrade the Blu-ray, but I don't know. I've just watched these discs so many times that I've got a love for these discs as well. Now for my guilty pleasure, and it is the High School Musical sets. I love that. I think these movies are absolutely brilliant. High School Musical one there. High School Musical two. Bit of a shiny box. High School Musical three. I didn't really get into these till I had a daughter, but I found myself sitting there watching them. And even when they're out, I'll sit and sing the songs. I've even got one of the songs bet on it on me phone for when I'm in the gym and I'm training to Zach Efron singing away in the gym. Everybody before obviously think that I like listen to Metallica or something like that, but no, I'm listening to Zach Efron. So there you go. That's my guilty pleasure, John. High school musical. You tell people you like them, and they're like, what? I think for like teenage girls, but they're not. They're good movies. And this, it's kind of a prized possession. It's just a DVD I'll never get rid of because it's the first DVD I ever bought when I got a DVD player. East is East. Really funny movie, really funny comedy. Just another little one there that, it's just the first one I ever bought, the first DVD, when I got my DVD player. So I'll never get rid of East is East either. So Mondo Chalavec. I will leave a link in his description. His channel at the minute is just like absolutely blown up. He's going to be on a thousand subscribers. What is now March? I would say by May, I would say John will be on a thousand subscribers. No problem at all. So I'm Mark. I like I say, I'll leave a link of his channel description. If you haven't gone over to his channel, he has some awesome stuff on. He has an awesome collection. If you look at that there, my cabinet, his is just a whole wall. Of DVDs, Blu-rays, 4Ks, different sort of collections. He's got a massive, massive collection. So I'm Mark. Subscribe to John. This is for the love of movies. Thanks very much and goodbye. Like an angel on your shoulder, see? And if you ever get hurt and you feel that you're going down, this little angel is going to whisper in your ear. He's going to say, get up, you son of a bitch. Mickey loves you.